All right, YouTube, David Harry here. Now, do you have a Samsung Galaxy Tab S7 or an S7 Plus? And are you looking for the absolute best in connectivity for your tablet? Well, look no further, because I found the best USB hub so far for my Galaxy Tab S7, and it is by Cable Creation. Now, as far as sockets are concerned, it has got HDMI output, which is also capable of going up to the highest resolution in DEX mode for the Tab S7, and that is 3440 by 1440. Then next to that, it has got a micro SD card slot and a full size SD card slot. And then next to those card slots, we have got two USB 3 ports as well. Next to the USB 3 ports, we have got a USB-C interface, which will allow for powering and charging. And then at the end of the hub, we have also got a gigabit Ethernet interface as well. So we simply just attach the USB-C end of the hub to our Galaxy Tab S7, and then we get access to all of those interfaces. And as you can see now, I have plugged in this cable creation USB-C hub into my Tab S7 there via the USB-C port. Also, I'm plugged into my external HDMI monitor using a HDMI cable. There's also a Wi-Fi receiver there plugged into the hub, which is for my mouse and keyboard. And I'm also connected to the internet there, which can mean only one thing, YouTube, because I've also got my Xbox Series X controller, Bluetooth to it. So what I'm gonna do now is flip over onto a screen grab and I will get into some gameplay. Okay, so what we're looking at here then is the desktop for my Tab S7 in DEX mode. Now, I could go on and show you all kinds of stuff to do with SD card speed tests, USB speed tests, internet speed tests and stuff like that. I'm not entirely sure whether people are into that stuff. And plus also, once you've seen one DEX desktop, you've probably seen them all. However, if there are things in there that people would like to see, let me know in the comments, and I'll most certainly revisit this in like other videos further down the line. But the one thing that I think people are gonna be buying these interfaces for are to play games on their TVs and monitors. So what I'm gonna do here is jump into a quick game of Call of Duty, and this should give us a really good idea of exactly how good this all looks. So what I'm gonna do is just flash through this until it can get into a game. Okay, so I've just joined into a game here for Search and Destroy. Let's see how we get on. I won't talk all the way through this because I'm just rubbish at trying to play and talk at the same time. So let's see if our team can win this game. Enemy contact. Bomb has been planted. Enemy down!
Reloading. Dog is in sight! Last man standing. Finish it. Lost that round, but it's not over yet. Ready up. Defend the objective. The enemy has the bomb. Dog it down! Reloading. I'm hurt. It's all up to you now. Finish the mission. They have the bomb. Nice work. Get ready for the next round. Destroy the objective. We got the bomb. Enemy contact! Last man standing. Finish it. Sniper! Lost the bomb. Lost that round, but it's not over yet. Ready up. Destroy the objective. We got the bomb. Target's in sight. The bomb has been planted. Tango down!
Nice work. Get ready for the next round. Destroy the objective. Bomb acquired. Enemy contact. Sim takes us. Headshot. I'm hurt. Enemy down. Okay, so there we go then, we won that game there. Anyways, this should be enough for people to see exactly what this USB-C hub is capable of. And if you would like to buy one of these, there will be links in the description to this video. If you've liked the video, please give it a thumbs up. Also consider subscribing to my channel and getting all over that bell notification icon. I'm David Harry. Thank you very much for watching this video. Take care and goodbye now.